Well, this is almost pleasant. Oh, you're gonna kill the lights. That's what you're gonna do. <laughs> Fucking called it! Man, I'm good. Do me a favor, like and subscribe. Mm-hmm. The Guardians may appear wise, but basically, they're very old. So old that they tend to talk rubbish. But luckily, they're here to protect the fragments. They just have to learn how to let go of them. Speaking of people talking rubbish, lady, um, you know how much shit you've been talking this entire time? A lot. Where, where, where's your puffy balls? There we go. Boink. So yeah, we're gonna go over to this region and see what it looks like, and we're gonna see if we can't, um, you know, get, get more elements uh, that would look good in the house. Um, I. <sighs> okay, there we go. Got it. <laughs> we good. We good, yo. We good. Uh, if the game was trying to depress me, it's doing a great job. <laughs> a banner. A vacation so ter- You're- I am busily experiencing PTSD every time someone mentions my vacation. Um, I- I'm like- I'm like- I'm like having tears well up in my eyes. I'm- I, I'm shaking a little bit. I'm about to like curl up in a ball on the floor, just sobbing, ch like chest sobbing, like from like the bottom of my stomach, trying to puke up the sadness from how bad this vacation was. How long did I wait to have this vacation? I had been saving up two years, two soul destroying years of vacation to go to, you know, Tahiti. For a week, one fuck week, not even a full week, really. I left on like the Saturday or the Sunday of the previous weekend, and then I needed to come on back on like the Saturday of the following weekend. I didn't get to like the whole thing either. It was a mess. Plane travel, don't even get me started on plane travel. This post dystopian bullshit that we're dealing with right now, you think trains are bad? Try fucking airplanes. In matter of fact, don't. They are tin cans with, you know, wings stapled on the side, and they mail you in pieces. In fucking pieces. You arrive on the other side, and they stitch you back together, and you get to hobble your way like a goddamn zombie with hip dysplasia trying to get to your fucking hotel room, and what happens when you get to your government-owned hotel room? They fuck you again, and goddamn... Damn, I am sick and fucking tired of that mint that they leave on my pillow being half fucking eaten. Yeah, okay, hotel staff, I get it. You're starving. You work 80 hours a week and you still can't feed yourself and your kids. But you know what? I ate my children and I liked them. To-do list. Get up at 6.40. Exactly. Not a minute before or after. Why 6.40? That gives me four, uh, 20 whole fucking minutes to give myself a fuck before 7. If I don't find a fuck before 7, stop giving any fucks, go back to bed. Try again tomorrow. If fucks found, move to item 2. <laughs> Drink an entire quart of milk. Don't puke. That's item number 3. Item number 4. Run 5 miles. Puke. <laughs> item 6. Dry cleaning. <laughs> um, item number seven. Get home naked, because you dropped all your clothes off at dry cleaning. Go to bed. Rinse. Repeat. No, okay. Boop. Come on. Let's, let's see it. Let's see those, let's see those eyes. There, no. Uh-huh, good. Good. Hey! Eh. Eh. Perfect. Oh, that's so cutie. You are. Good. <laughs> uh, okay. Hey, guys. I'm going to leave this video right here. I'm going to catch you on the flip side. Take care, everybody.